Hey guys, uh, welcome to Pikmin again. Last time we left off with 81 Pikmin, and I have gotten just a couple more, so that now we have 92. So, today I plan to discover a new thingy, and which you don't know, but I do, because I've played through this game about a thousand times, and then possibly enter a cave. It would be cool if we could enter a cave, but I don't know how time is going to work out. Now, the new thing that we have discovered is gumballs. Except these aren't really gumballs. I'll just call them gumballs, because they look like gumballs. They grow on those plants, because, you know, gum grows on plants. That makes a lot of sense. Wait a second. Okay. So... Yeah, let's just watch, because this is a weird thing. Now we're getting a lecture on it. Ooh, an ultra spicy sauce. Okay. Uh, bring me another specimen. Thanks for being demanding. And there's another one. And what you can do with these gumballs, these ultra spicy gumballs, is... dot dot dot. Wait for it. Well, there's this gooey substance. And then it calls it... Yes, a powerful potion. It is an ultra spicy spray, and what it does is, since you probably are not going to want to read all this, if you press down on the D-pad, then uh, you make all your Pikmin energetic and excited, and they will be ultra powered for the rest of a minute or something. Maybe it's like two minutes, I don't know. Now, what you can do with this is, if you want, you could use it right now, for instance, if you were to want to break the store down rather fast, which I kind of do. And here's the result. Yes, super fast! And they're glowing, and it increases speed and attack power, and guess what happens? That. So they'll work for a little bit, and you'll realize how fast they can do this. Because the other, the other one spent way too long, you know, breaking that door down. But now, now it's not that bad. Come on, you're making me look bad here. Actually, prove me right. Okay, see? That didn't take long. So I'm just gonna go around and do some stuff. That doesn't work. You know. Look around. Oh, they're almost done. I don't want to leave them unattended to, for they will not like it. Uh-oh. Some are dying out. Yeah, so this, this does not last forever. And now they're back to normal. It might take a bit. I, I thought I heard one become normal before all the rest of them, and I'm hoping that I didn't lose one in the process. In this process. But, since I don't really want to cut any of this out, because I've been talking the entire time, and I'm too lazy. Uh, I mean, I'm too busy. Um, I'll just continue to wait forever. Okay, here we go. And we have knocked this bridge down. What is this? What is it doing? Oh no. How do you do that? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that from playing this game for a while, what you have to do... Okay, creepy chrysan chrysanthemum. Chrysanthemum. Ah, speak correctly. Dead. And I do think it revives itself. Or something. Hold on, maybe it doesn't. No, I guess it doesn't. Maybe I'm thinking of another enemy that we will meet later. Um, but since we've finished all this, though, and I kind of want to do this, we'll just go ahead and look at another pile of sparkling dog poo. And Kurz burst. You know, a large Pikmin group would be reassuring, but, you know, only 83. You can only have 100 out at a time, so... And we see that there are flames inside, as indicated by the thingy, and we jump inside. And now for the real action, because all the other action wasn't actually real, it was all in your mind. The game has been saved. Hooray! The, the GameCubes are savior. Okay. So what is going on? What is, what is going on? Nothing over here. I'll just wander around. I'm an expert at exploring caves. Mm. Yeah, I'm such an expert. 
bird. I have no idea what's going on. Oh no, the harmful of the the harmful versions of the thingies that are not harmful. You see them over there? Yeah, they can. Actually, I want to clear the cave out of everything ever before I start. You know, because these things can be dangerous. Except they aren't. They're never gonna kill more than one. Um. Yeah, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what I guess. Where did all the other ones go? Oh, I guess they're carrying some of them back. Might as well. No more wasting time. <laughs> I'm totally not doing that. Oh, they're actually kind of worth a lot, so I'll bring them back. Oh, look, what's that? Oh my, it's an NES controller pad paddle thing. Why is it here? Oh, right, because we're on Earth. Kill it. Kill it all. Completely harmless, but I'll bring it back because I'm an evil person. And I like to profit off of dead bodies. Yeah, that was creepy. Sorry. Is there anything else in here? I would think there is, but maybe not. Yay! What is this? It is a stone of glory. <laughs> Yeah, they're only just slightly prop, you know, making them feel themselves feel better. And that sound indicates that there are no treasures in this floor. No more. So, let's find our next hole. Assuming I can. I'm known to be blind. Uh, don't know what any of that means. I'm gonna assume it's over there somewhere. Over, yeah, here it is. So, let's speed up a little bit. Yes, delve deeper with my pigment. Yay! Okay, so we are entering the next hole. I wonder what exciting things will happen there. Ooh. Hole of Beasts, that's the name of this place. Because it's filled with beasts, quite clearly. The the beasts that kind of, that kill you and murder you. Oh yes, all that. Uh nothing over here. Great. How about over here? Oh look, purple pigment thingies. Well, let's go through here and transform some of them. Let's wait for that, and turn some more, and wait for those. Let's pick them. So now we have ten more purple pigment, and Collecting a hundred purple pigment, I'm just gonna spoil a little bit of this story here, is what you're gonna need to do by the end of the game. Because otherwise, people will be sad. And I think there's like a playing card somewhere in this, in this one. Maybe not. Maybe there isn't. Maybe I'm just crazy. There's an egg. I want to make some of these faster, so... So what these nectars do is that. They make your Pikmin all girly and nice. Uh, and they also make them faster. Enhanced motor skills, yeah. It's actually pretty useful and, you know, not annoying. So, so now that about half, maybe a little less of our... Oh, here's some more. Great. And sometimes these eggs have nectars that will help Olimar and Louie. Like, you know, the ultra spicy spray and, a, and another spray that we have not gotten to yet. Anything else? No, I guess not. Don't blame me if I l do not get anything. And guess what? We're like already out of time. Wow. Well, we have like a minute left, but really I don't think that's enough to continue on anywhere. So we'll go into the next hole. Oh no, we have like two minutes left. We're okay. I don't know. It all depends on life and the universe and everything. And the question that will never be revealed. Unless if you want the universe to be replaced with something else. Oh god. Oh god, fires. So here's another cool sorting feature. If you press X and disband all your people, uh, they will separate. 
so that you can get all reds and no purples, for instance, or all, all, yeah, that's it so far. That's all you can do. So, uh, probably I'll have to redo this because I'm not going to get through this, this last cave, this last level. But there is a Mahjong tile there. And I'll just leave that there, actually, because I won't finish this floor. Let's just explore, and then so there's a floppy disk, and I think that's it for this floor. And then... So yeah, I'll cut the segment a little short right now. You know, 30 seconds left. So thank you for watching, and stay tuned for next time for more treasure hunting and shenanigans, I suppose. Alright, bye.